Tutorial 108 about using the anchor point in dimensioning. In the previous tutorial, we showed you how to get the intersection point. Also, there is another way to find some tricky points, which called the anchor points. For example, let's activate the linear dimensioning and let's make dimensions between this line and this line. Since it is a simple drawing here, it might be easy to handle it, but in case of complicated geometries, you will know how important the anchor points. So to get to the anchor points, now before you finish with your dimensioning, right click and here you can see you don't see the anchor points options and if you didn't see the anchor points option that means it is there is no chance for the anchor points so just click escape and again let's try to make dimension between this line this line right click and we try to find the anchor points so in this case we're having no chance for anchor points so again let's activate the linear dimensioning let's change the type of dimensioning and here again it's this line this line right click you can't find the anchor again let's change to this type this line this line right click and here if you look extension lines anchors so you have the anchor one and anchor two so you will have the dimension changed so as we said this is a simple drawing in some cases there are tricky places that you are not able to check some points then the anchor point selection will be useful in that case